Hi students, welcome to my YouTube channel Rukesh Gupta Chemistry Classes. Today our topic is Prochiral Pro -pro Center. What is Prochiral Center? In my previous topic I explained the Chiral Center. What is Chiral Center? It is the sp3 hybridized atom which is attached to four different groups. Now what is Prochiral Center? It is an echiral atom, means not chiral. Echiral atom, which is capable of converting, which is capable of becoming chiral in single desymmetrization step. In single desymmetrization step, means in single step, means once by substituting an atom with another atom, or once by adding some atom. Uh, in one single desymmetrization step, if that atom is capable of converting into the chiral, then that is called prochiral center. Next, pro prochiral center. And this one also, an achiral atom means not chiral, an achiral atom which is capable of becoming chiral in two desymmetrization steps, means in two substitution steps means at that atom, if two atoms are substituted with different atoms, then it becomes chiral. Or in the simple language, if an atom attached to four atoms, out of four, two are different, remaining two are identical. Now, those two identical, among them, if you substitute that one with a new different atom, that becomes chiral, now that is called prochiral. So, prochiral will be attached to two different atoms, remain to our identical atoms. Next to pro prochiral, it will be attached to, now at that to, only two types of atoms will be there. One atom of one, one type, remaining three atoms are same type. Now, three same type of atoms are there. No? From that three, if you substitute two with different different atoms, now it becomes chiral. Now such atom is called pro pro chiral. For example, now you take the normal butane CH three, CH two, CH two, CH three. Now this carbon attached to methyl, ethyl, two hydrogens. Now it is pro chiral. Now this one also, this carbon attached to methyl, ethyl, two hydrogens. So it is pro, now it is attached to propyl, three hydrogens, no? so it is pro, pro chiral. This one also pro, pro chiral. See for example, now here two hydrogens are not there, no? now one hydrogen substituted with deuterium. Single desymmetrization step. Now this is becoming chiral. So that's why this atom comes under prochiral center. Now here also two hydrogens are there. No? Now one hydrogen gets substituted with deuterium. Now at this atom four different groups are there. No? Now it is chiral. So that's why it will come under prochiral center. Next, if I take this one. This carbon attached to three hydrogens, one propyl. Huh? Now out of three hydrogens, one hydrogen substituted with deuterium, another hydrogen substituted with tritium, means two desymmetrization steps. Now it becoming chiral. So that's why it comes under pro pro chiral center. This one also. This one also comes under this atom also comes under pro pro chiral center. So in the normal butane, in the normal butane, chiral centers 0, pro chiral centers 2, pro pro chiral centers 2. Next, now this pro chiral center, not only the sp3 carbon, it may be sp2, planar triangle, sp2 carbon also. For example, you take the propanoid hive. You take the propanoidy hide. Propanoidy hide. 
Now see, this is not chiral now. This one also not chiral center now. This one also not chiral center now. Now, here if you add, here if you add some group, for example, C n minus I added, C n minus. Now, it is becoming, now it becoming chiral now. So now that's why this comes under prochiral center. See, at this sp2 carbon, at this sp2 carbon, due to one single desymmetrization step. Here, what is that one? Addition, not substitution. Addition of Cl minus or addition of something, some different atom. Now, this is becoming chiral center. No? That's why this sp2 carbon, carbonyl carbon in propanaldehyde is a prochiral center. Now this one already you know. It is attached to two different groups. The remaining two atoms are same. So it is prochiral. Why? Because out of two hydrogens, if one hydrogen is substituted with deuterium, now it becoming chiral. Now. So this one becoming chiral atom after single desymmetrization step. So it is prochiral. Now what about this one? It will come under, it will come under pro pro chiral. Why? Because here three similar atoms are there now. Out of three hydrogens. One hydrogen substituted with deuterium, one hydrogen substituted with tritium. Now it becoming, now it becoming, uh, now it will become chiral. So that's why it is the, it is the pro pro chiral center. So this is the difference between pro-chiral, pro-pro-chiral center. Okay students, if you like this video, please subscribe my channel and click on the bell icon to get all my notifications. Bye students, we will meet again with another new concept.